Hey guys! Okay, so I wanted to talk about something that's really, really cool. Excuse my messy desk. I just finished writing my album, and it's a weird feeling. Like, it's good. I feel really accomplished. It's just like, the first song I wrote for this record was in 2011. It's weird to have all the songs written and done. Now it's like, I have to go and record and make everything sound pretty, blah 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 blah. Having my last couple of years down on paper, it's kind of surreal. Like I created this office and suddenly just like whipped out everything really fast. Having a creative space has made a huge difference. Like I'm really happy. The record ended up being a bit darker than what I thought it was gonna end up being, but it's, it's fine. You know, the last couple of years haven't been exactly easy, so really kind of releasing that and saying what I need to say, it's nice to kind of have it out. <laughs> out of my body, out of my brain, down on paper. So what I'm doing now is I'm gonna bind all of my lyrics because I'm super OCD like that. So when I record, they're all in one place. I'm excited. Like, I really think this record is gonna fly now. Eep, 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 eep. You know, you put so much effort into something for so long. It's like, okay, you finally feel like things are moving again. I can't wait to share it with you guys. It's so far from my last record. Just sonically and musically and lyrically, it's just very different. I've said this multiple times. The record is actually mostly about situations that have happened in my life in the past couple of years. And me just kind of getting through it or expanding on that or twisting it into something fun. And there's only one song on the record that's about one person. Everything else is about multiple people or situations with people, you know, how I dealt with it or situations that were around me. It's very mature and I know that sounds weird being 24. <laughs> Writing such a mature record, God, I am so adult now. <laughs> it's very like, this is it. I don't really feel sorry for anything that I'm gonna say. I don't like throwing people under the bus, but at the same time, like, when people post videos about pains and struggles that we all go through, usually the first people to respond are the people that were the ones who were mean to you. And it's like, well, if you don't like me exposing you for your hurtful words and actions and whatever, maybe you shouldn't have been mean in the first place. There's a song I wrote recently called Resentment that is very, it's very, I, I don't really want to say it's very personal because it is. All of the songs on the record are very personal. It's just this one rung a bell because it's about something that happened the most recently in my life. It's like kind of the last event that I wanted to put on the record. Even though I'm not actually resentful anymore, partly because I wrote a song called Resentment, it's probably the most like, well, how about you try being a nice person and then I can tell the world about you being a nice person. No? You're gonna be mean? Okay. Well, then I'll tell the world about how mean you are. But at the same time, the album has happy songs too. There's good stuff on there, and I can't wait to share it with you all. That was actually not the video I was gonna do this week, but I felt like since that happened, I wanted to talk about it, kind of get you guys more informed about my next album and what's coming and how excited I am to share it with you. All right, you guys, that's gonna be it this week. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe, and all the fun things. And I will see you next Wednesday. Peace out. I can see it all so clearly now that I've moved on. Now that I moved on. Say you're in love and take off and leave. That's fine. I like you better gone. Subscribe. Blah, 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 blah.